Uh, really a hard fought basketball game. Uh, really a hard, hard fought basketball game. Versus a great team and a team we have great respect for. And, uh, and, and our effort wasn't good enough. Um, we played hard. We played very well. Uh, we didn't play perfect. And they're so dang good that you almost have to play perfect. Play perfect. And that's not realistic. Uh, certainly, we would have liked to have made a few more free throws. Didn't get to a lot. You know, would have liked to have shot the three better. You know, but you're not going to play perfect versus that kind of team. You're going to, you have to anticipate that you're not going to play perfect. But we played our tails off, and it just wasn't quite good enough. Uh, they got a great team, and, 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 and give them credit because they're, they're, they're just terrific. Yeah, but clearly, uh, you make a few front ends, and you could have kept it interesting, even though they kind of asserted their will toward the end. Uh, you, you tired, maybe, from playing that hard, or you think the moment was, was, was just big for those guys? First of all, I think it stayed interesting to the end, myself. Um, we just didn't get to the free throw line enough to get a rhythm there. You know, um, it took us forever to get our first attempt, so we just didn't get there enough to have a rhythm, and we didn't make free throws. Um, but um, certainly, yeah, if we'd have made a few one-on-ones, it could have maybe tied it a little more, but um, we didn't do it. Mark, was your message to them pretty much what you just said to us? Uh, in terms of to our team? Yeah. Exactly. I mean, I'm, I'm proud of it. Because you know what? We had a great crowd, and our crowd rolled their sleeves up, and they, they saddled up right with us and said, hey, we're going we're gonna to give it all we got. And our player says, you know what? We're going to give it all we got. And it wasn't good enough. But there's no shame in, in losing to a team like that. And uh, I'm really proud for how they competed and represented our team, our school. We just didn't win. And um, we, just made a, we just made a few too many errors. The natural follow-up to that is, can you actually build on this? I mean, you, you want to win all your games, but there's probably some belief coming out of this that you can hang with that team that long. I'm going to look at the tape, and I'm going to go in there tomorrow and say we should have won a game. Just like we should have won a game in a row. But you got to be, you got to just play some fewer mistakes. That's a lot to expect to say, hey, you damn near have to play perfect to beat them. But, you know, I think we understand that, that I think our team believes in each other, that we have a good team. Um, but, um, you know, I don't believe in moral victories. Um, but hopefully they realize that when we, when we saddle up and really get after it, we got a good team. Mark, to struggle on threes the way you all did and, and still be up by nine at one point and have this game be as close as it was throughout, what is that a testament to, to what you all were able to do otherwise? Well, I mean, we shot 47% from the field. You know, sometimes you get a three-point shot against Kentucky because that's all you can get, and that shot's guarded because they got one of the best defensive teams of all time. And, you know, uh, so some of the threes that we shot were just a result of their great defense, so give them credit. Um, you know, we had a lead there, and we just, you know, we just couldn't, um, you know, we just couldn't hold it. You know, we just couldn't hold it. Mark, how important was it to have a good rotation and get a bunch of guys playing in the first half to keep everybody strong for the second? Yeah, I don't think we got fatigued. I think we, I thought we rotated our, our, our team pretty well. Uh, I thought, I thought, um, you know, the fact that we have kind of a healthy roster now, we were able to play more guys. Uh, had a little issue with some fouls there in the first half, but, but not major. Um, and you need depth against Kentucky because they got so many guys. How good was Nemi in that first half for you guys and really carried you? Well, Nemi was great. I mean, Nemi was great. And, you know, obviously, you know, I'm sure at halftime they talked about how we're going to, you know, how we're going to slow Jurisdiction down. But he was great. And, and uh, he played like a, like a senior. And, and Marcus Thornton played like a senior. Those guys were terrific. And, um, again, you know, we didn't play perfect. And we darn near have to against a team like that. And we didn't do it.